Previously on Cat Clips. After the cats got a new kitchen to play in and Boots suggested Tippy date both he and Tuck at the same time, Tippy confessed to Trey and Honey that she really was in love with Tuck and no longer moving to Hollywood. Cat Clips. Cat Clips. Cat Clips. Cat Clips. This summer is going by so fast. Can you believe it's August already? No. I also can't believe we're both being horribly upstaged by a friggin' plant. I mean, what is this? Little Shop of Horrors? Hmm, I knew they were around here somewhere. Hmm. Hey, Tippy, what are you doing? Bobbing for cobwebs? No, our owner spilled a big bowl of M&Ms in here last night. I was just looking for the survivors. Were they plain or peanut? I'm not sure. No fair hunting for them until... Hey, is that one? No, just a crumpled up paper dropping. Probably a bill. <laughs> Oh, wait, I see something. Oh, joy, oh, rapture. Mm -hmm. This doesn't taste like an M&M. &M. Oh, it's sour and sweet. It's a sweet tart. Yum. Oh, any more? I've always thought sweet tarts tasted like concentrated Kool-Aid. Interesting. Anyway, I'm glad you're both here, because I feel I need to explain something I said the other day. Oh, wait, I think I see one. I see one. I see one. Gotcha. Mm, hey, come back here. <laughs> mm, oh, now this one is a Reese's Pieces. A.T. found home. Elliot. Hey, look, there's a squirrel planking on that tree over there. Or is he owling? Oh, no, he's just crapping. Tuck, feel free not to verbalize everything you think about, because sometimes dead air is just fine. <laughs> oh, our owner's snoring is making me tired, which is weird since a ghost's natural state is insomnia. He's sleeping in his desk chair? That's weird. Well, you know what happens when these humans get older. They could nap on a roller coaster. Which reminds me, has Tippy's love roller coaster come into the station yet, or is she still out there hurdling hills? I still think she has a few more hurdles to get over, namely telling Tuck and breaking it to Boots. What is she waiting for? Who knows? Kids these days, so much drama. Yeah. Hey, do you think I should try to wake our owner up? I mean, it is almost time for our dinner. I'm sure he wouldn't want to miss that. Hey, owner, wake up. Eh, not a budge. Oh, look, a dangler. Cool, I love these. And, and you know, if you pull on them long enough, they sometimes get even bigger. Not to mention the fact that they make excellent dental floss. Oh, I've been trying to get the seed out of my gums for the last week. Oh, oh, almost got it. All that pulling and still our owner doesn't wake up. It's like trying to revive Lindsay Lohan's career. At some point, you just got to say, why bother? Is that a challenge? Because now I'm not giving up until I either get dinner or a back scratch. Oh, see, his foot moved. That means there's hope. Oh, and a hand. <laughs> he must think I'm a fly. Ah. Oh, I have all these little threads caught in my teeth. I hate when that happens. Ah, it's like eating celery, which is probably the only reason celery is considered healthy, because it forces you to pick at your teeth afterwards. But this guy sure isn't taking a hint. I may have to resort to a different tactic. Is there a bucket of water handy? No? Okay. What to do, what to do. Oh, I know. I'll use feline mind control on him. You will wake up now. Do you hear me, human? Michael! Oh, cool, it's working. Okay, so now what do I say? Oh, I know. You have an urgent desire to pet a black cat. When a black cat appears on your lap, you will greet him with the words, Hey, Trey, can I pet you today? And then pet him. <laughs> hey, Trey. Can I pet you today? It worked! So good, there's another one. 
Oh no, that's just a pebble. Why are there so many pebbles in this house? You'd think we were the Flintstones. Oh, how did I miss this one? Mmm, the skills. I wonder what this tastes like. Poison, probably. Oh, maybe I'll just skip that then. Hey, Tippy, weren't you going to explain something to us? I was? Oh, right, I was. Okay, let's see. Um, remember how I said I didn't want to date both of you? Well, it was because I finally figured out who I really belong with. It's not Justin Bieber, is it? Because I hear he's really into coning. Again, another mindless human pastime. Almost as bad as being a congressman. No, it's not Justin Bieber. But as you know, in passion, one day you're in, and the next day you're out. So, boots, you're out, tuck, you're in. You win, Project Tippy! I mean, um, I'm sorry, Boots, you've been great, but Tuck is really much more suited to me. I hope you understand. Oh, uh, okay. I'm sorry, are you okay, Boots? Oh, sure, these things happen. Where are you going? Uh, to the porch. I, I need some fresh air. Poor guy. You probably broke his heart, Tippy. I mean, better his than mine, but still. Um, forget Boots. Shouldn't you be jumping down here to kiss me or something? I mean, I did just tell you that I love you. Really? Because it sounded much more like I'd won you in some kind of competition. Don't get me wrong, I think it's great and all, Tippy, but I can't be happy right now when Boots is obviously hurting. I've got to help him out. Hey, Boots, are you okay? I'm fine. I just need some time to process my feelings, and uh, a couple of shots of whiskey wouldn't hurt either. Well, that did not go at all like I imagined. <laughs>